Hi, Kalpun Piso here. On my previous video, Come, or you faithful, I explain where a religious beliefs originated from. All of them from sex and from the stars. That was a mystery to the ancients. Now I'm going to talk about the psychopathy and of this uh, form of mental illness and retardation and uh, how come Christians consider sex so evil and sinful and deviant. Uh, well, they are retarded and they have a problem with their brains. They're stuck in the 12th century. I'll An ape it. and a human being are to me like a Model T Ford and a 2008 Thunderbird. Thunderbird. Same structure, right there. All the elements. In other words, we're actually a, a better, more improved model of this. Apes. We, we are simply evolved mutated primates. We're animals. Uh, DNA proves it. Mutations prove it. The genes between uh, uh, great apes and us is uh, like... To all mutated the primates use to procreate. I call it penis. This is the I call altar it penis. in which penis Christ deposits his milky offerings, creating offerings. The ancients didn't know this at all. They thought, they didn't know what the brain was. They saw that uh, we, we thought and the soul, the spirit and everything else was in the heart. And sex, of course, was sacred. They didn't know what the, the semen was and the biological process. None of it. So over 35,000 years ago, primitive men began to worship the overgrowth of creations and the stars as sacred. And then, of course, the Egyptians uh, uh, began to organize the religious beliefs, here adorating the sun and penis. From the 5,000-year-old uh, religious beliefs, especially from the Book of the Dead, uh, the immense, vast Roman Empire, when it became an empire, uh, created from that sacred sex, created their and sacred and sex. All the religious their... beliefs were different. They, they believed in many, many gods, and uh, basically one, and sex was no problem. Sex was sacred. All of them here. In the fourth century, um, after his victory of the Emperor Maxentius in Rome, the criminal Constantine decided to unite the religion, one religion accepted. Well, this created intolerance because then only one religion in this, such a vast empire. And that, uh, you know, that began, uh, the, everything went downhill and intellectual stagnation and uh, sex became a sin and the church controlled everything and you want to just learn one thing and believe in one thing. And uh, that created the dark ages and created... Uh, Sex a sin. And sex became The a Roman sin. Empire was vast. And it had many, many religious, many religious... All religious beliefs are based on sacred sex and the stars. And uh, the Western world is based on, the, uh, uh, on Christianity, on the worship of the Christus. Uh, even the United States, everything here uh, that you see is based on that. From the vast Roman Empire, from the only holy city in this empire, Rome, and its rituals emerge what we know today as Judaism, believe it or not, uh, Christianity, is hundreds of versions, and uh, Islam, it's hundreds of versions. Penis, vagina, and breast are equated with the divine stars as seen here. Penis Christ. In the vast Roman Empire, sex was, as I said, sacred. Nothing wrong with sex, and uh, women express their breast and you know uh, the penis and all that. It was worship, and uh, it was considered very sacred. Uh, uh, everybody was bisexual by nature. Sex was not a big deal. Uh, it was actually very sacred. Um, uh, gay men, uh, gay lady, gay uh, ladies, uh, lesbians. It was actually sacred, you know, from Lesbos. And uh, so it was no problem. A man can be married, have their, uh, their wife, and have their, their male lovers, you know. Like in Greek, it was very common and very normal. There were fears. There were no pants and little fags, like they say. No, they were very fierce, but it was very normal. Christian retardation and psychosis turned everything upside down, and it created pedophilia, it created intolerance, it created genocide, psychopathy, 
and uh, stagnated the intellect. America had been infected with this Christian cancer that came over in the Mayflower. I wish the boat would have sunk. Less lunatics here. Raping, killing, enslaving the natives. Regarding the fear of the devil in his followers was Puritan preacher Jonathan Edwards. His commanding sermon, Sinners of an Angry God, demands all be righteous or face the horrors of hell. See? There is no want of power in God to cast wicked men into hell at any moment. People that believe only in one book and read only one book are retarded. And uh, those that believe fantasies to be reality are demented and belong in... Yeah, retarded these people were. years after Salem, legal cases involving the devil were rarely seen in American courts. But they still believe in that but today. suddenly, with the satanic ritual craze of the 1980s and 90s, he was back. Yeah. Hundreds Can of parents and from care workers Christ in Britain psychosis. and the United States were accused of abusing thousands of children in bizarre witches' Sabbaths. When supposed victims failed to support allegations, they were said to be in denial. There were retarded, intolerant, psychopathic belief systems origin are a distortion of the tolerant uh, beliefs of the Roman Empire. Create God with our brains. Neurology clears, clearly proves it. These poor, deluded Christians in their ignorance do not realize many words used here in the Western world, the United States, originated from sacred sex. For instance, Old Testament, New Testament, testimony, they originate from testes, mysterious sacred seed contained in the scrotum, the sack, the holy sack hanging between our legs. Two heads, the upper head, our testa, and the bottom one, the glands, the head of our penis, that was anointed with olive oil for easy penetration and adoration. There is no morality in Christianity, and the anti-gay, retarded, Christian Mormons do not realize that marriage was never between only a man and a woman. Retards. The Adam image Earth. of Mary Man in a 4,000-year-old tomb. Seven. Members of the Bancher Party have been under attack for five days by local Mormon militia and Paiute Indians. We read to a truce offer, but it's a double cross. Settlers are promised to be taken to safety. Look at the crash I got. Children are gathered into wagons while their men march single file nearby. Which is basically when the command was called out, do your duty. They turned on their individual prisoners and killed them on the spot. It's Christians. Hired Indians spring from hiding. They slaughtered the children. And they slaughtered the women. They scalped them, dismembered them, stripped them of clothing. Um, eventually, the wounded in the wagons were killed as well. But even then, only one is punished. Of course. On March 23rd, 1877, John D. Lee, the man who made the false offer of safe passage, hypocrites, typical, is convicted for his role in the magic. For his so there you have it. The this Christ psychotic, retarded people, infected with this Christian immorality, deviancy, left England. 1622. We're going to have Thanksgiving, right? And they are the cause of all the problems. Mayflower had escaped England because the homosexual King James I had introduced a new Bible. So they escaped with the old Geneva Bible to the Americans. Deluded, retarded, immoral Joseph Smith created another branch of Christianity. Another branch of this lunacy. There is no morality in Christianity. There is creators of pedophilia, intolerance, and intellectual stagnation. They belong in mental institutions.